Who the fuck? Hello. Okay. This is Sybil. Good. You look horrible. And you're missing an arm. Yep. Go over there. What the hell? Put your things down. Let me out! Who's out there? Um... Quiet, please, sweetie. Your things. There. What things? Uh... This is all I've got, okay? You travel light. I don't believe you. What the fuck? That's everything. Go ahead and search me. No, I'm not touching you. Just sit down. Yeah, I don't trust this guy one bit. Do you know who I am? No. No. I don't know anything about you. You wouldn't. People like you don't. Who am I? Now you're thinking. Who would have it out for me, huh? A few weeks back, there might have been a station wagon in the forest, full of all sorts of food, water, things you need to survive. Yeah. I'm not some cannibal, Lee. Some killer out in the woods. Some villain. I'm just a dad. I coach Little League. Everything was just out there for the taking. We were starving. Do for the you... taking? Do you know what you took from me? Oh! Uh. I'm sorry. Try to... Whatever it is. I, we, oh! I forgot episode you two. To hear that I'm sorry. You took the I thing out of the dude's car. To me. I wish it did. I'm not a bad man. I don't believe in vengeance. But I've got nothing left. So you're telling me none of this would have happened? If I didn't have take his stuff? Hurt somebody you care about? Um... Have I? I don't remember. Not on purpose. If it were on purpose, you'd be a sociopath. I hurt her. So bad. My son Adam went missing. I took him out hunting even though my wife said he was too young. I figured he had to learn. I came back without him and the look on her face said... You are a monster. Oh. We all went out looking for him. We never found him. I hurt her so bad. This is some crazy guy, pretty much. Then you took all of our things. You robbed us. I could have earned her trust back, Lee, but not after that. <sighs> Ooh, I should say you fucked up. But I'm not, I'm it's not, not my fault. I'm not blaming on me. The hungrier we got, the more she blamed me. Until she finally took our daughter Elizabeth and left. They didn't get far. I found them a day later in the road. Do I look like a monster to you? Yes. Ooh, that's that's a, and I, we all do. We all do. Some more than others. I'm not like you. You killed a man with a pitchfork right in front of a little girl. Um. It's more complicated than that. You abandoned a defenseless, grieving woman. When was that? Uh. You weren't there. The sweatshirt she's wearing was my boy's. 
You stole that from us. That's... I'm just gonna be like, uh, you got it all wrong. That's not the whole story. The whole story? How could you know all this? The fuck? What does that mean? You're a monster. You're a murderer and a thief, and I'm gonna hurt you so bad. Uh, kill him now. Uh. It doesn't have to be this way. You can't take care of anyone. After I heard Clementine on the radio and realized who you folks were, I came after you purely for revenge. But the more I heard about the things you did and the danger she was in, our plan changed. Lead, listen to me. I need you to hear this before what happens next. I can take care of her. We can have a family. I bet you don't even know how old she is. She's eight. Wrong. She's nine. But... Her birthday was six days ago. How do you know that? I know how to be a dad, you know. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Um. No. No. Shut up. It makes sense. It's not happening. Uh. Let us go. No. No, I don't think so. You're going away. And we're starting a new family. What a piece of shit. Pedophile motherfucker. Okay. Hey, honey. I think this is all gonna work out. What are you... What? I'm glad too. I wish it wouldn't have had to get this bad, but... It's all over, hon. Isn't it? Just about. I hate seeing you like this. I just miss your smile, honey. Ah, oh, shit. I miss you so much, Tess. I should have picked the lamp. I like Clementine a lot, though. She's not Lizzie, but she's sweet. She wouldn't hurt a fly. <laughs> Fuck, get him. <laughs> nope, get him. Fuck him up. It's time. I'm had enough of you. Do something. We ain't done here. <laughs> Fucking there you go. Press A. Get him. Get him. Beat the fuck out of him. Piece of shit. Oh, I'm not pressing A hard enough. Fuck. Dude, I'm pressing A so fucking hard right now. Are you kidding me? Come on, come on, come on. Kill the son of a bitch. No, I went away. Kill him. End his life. Ah. Huh. <sighs> Ooh, good workout. How you liking now? Now they put the bullet through his head. He then turn back into a walker. End this now. Um. Fucking shoot him. Thank you. He would have come back. Yeah. That's right, sweet. See, you know what needs to happen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. Yes. Victory. A nice victory. Your arm's gone. Why? <laughs> it's so scary. I had an accident. Talk about it somewhere safe. You don't smell good. Yeah, I know. Um. Did he hurt you? No. Not really. I'm sorry, Lee. Clem, it's okay. We need to get you somewhere safe. And then we have to talk, okay? Yeah. 
Everything's okay now. We need to figure out how to get out of Savannah as fast as we can. Okay. What are you looking at? No, he's dead. He ain't coming back. Don't worry about that. I'm sorry you had to see that. He was going to kill you. And take you. Yeah. And hurt you. Uh, am I supposed to... Oh, I think I think the girl's head was in there. Ooh, it's alive! Jesus. Don't look in there. No, I know. How the hell? How do you do that? Alright, Clementine, what do you want? Which way out? Through there. Someone's out here waiting for me. Look, look through the peephole. Out to the hallway. Look through the peephole. <sighs> Not good. <gasps> Who the fuck? You're out of bullets? Oh. I thought you were out of bullets. It, it didn't bite you. Yeah. Oh, that's I bad. Must have. You're covered in all that gross stuff. Yeah, Lee is over. Get through a bunch of them to get here. So they think you're. Yeah, Lee's a walker. It's over. That's how we'll get out of Savannah. Oh, cover Clementine and all that stuff. Oh, is the smell? I don't get it. What's... They smell horrible. Which means you have to, too. Yuck. Okay. Oh, she said okay. She said alright. Oh, no. Ugh. Ooh. <laughs> I'm gonna throw that on her. Uh. Oh. Oh. Uh. We'll get you cleaned up as soon as we can. Yeah. Not soon enough. Yeah, probably not. It's me that. Oh. All our back. Oh. Ah. Oh yeah. Are you done? No, on the face. More. I want to be sure. Right on the face. Put it right on her face. No, put it on her face. <laughs> on her cheek. Right under her nose. Yeah, that should do it. I hope so. Oh, she looks kind of sad. And you're missing something. Oh, your hat. I thought it was gone. Smear a little on the hat. I thought you were gone. Thank you. We can do this. Let's go. Stay right next to me. Walk very slowly. Don't look around. And don't panic. Mm -hmm. I'll keep you safe. No, I guess... How, how do we just realize this is what we have to do? I mean, all we have to do is cover ourselves in their smell. And we can just walk past them without a big deal. <laughs> 